Hi, my name is Doug Ainsley. I'm a Oregonian native and a graduate, 1979, from Portland State University. As I made my way through Portland State, uh, I then went on to OHSU, to dental school, and graduated there in 1983. But along the way, at dental school, I had a growing concern about being a general dentist and all that it required to be uh, so proficient at. And, and because of that concern, I felt I would be best um, satisfied by having a specialty to work in. And so as I began looking at different specialties, whether it was oral surgery or orthodontics, pedodontics, uh, my orthodontist, uh, uh, who I went to as a kid, encouraged me to go talk to practitioners that had been out for many, many years. And so in doing that, I found that the orthodontist that I talked to had a great uh, level of satisfaction with their careers and the practice and the work they were doing 20 and 30 years later. I spent some time being concerned about being a general dentist because of how broad and how many different areas you, I, I thought you had to be really expertise in. As a result, I wanted to focus my practice to a certain, to a specific area, a specialty, and so I went out to um, check into a, a few different specialties including oral surgery, uh, orthodontics, pedodontics, so when I graduated from dental school in 1983, I uh, graduated with honors from OHSU and was um, accepted at Northwestern University in Chicago for an orthodontic residency. It's a two-year program. And at the end of that, I had a certificate as well as a master's degree in orthodontics. Upon graduating there in 1985, I moved back to Portland and began a practice in downtown Portland and there was a pedodontist who was an instructor of mine at OHSU who gave me an opportunity to begin a practice in uh, the area where he was practicing. And uh, I've maintained that practice and also practice in Westland, Oregon also. Like many dentists, I belong to a number of uh, dental <coughs> and or orthodontic organizations. I'm also board certified in orthodontics.